Good afternoon, everyone. Thank you very much for listening to me today. My name is Ana de Jesus. I'm a PhD candidate in computational mathematics at the University of São Paulo, Brazil. I'm currently working uh, with Chapel to develop a specific code and fluid dynamic to simulate the atmospheric boundary layer in Amazon forest. So we have placed my question as part of the develop this code. So in this presentation, I'm going to talk the results obtained from the parallel implementation with Chapel for the numerical solution of the 3D Poisson problem. My group work with you for trend in addition to MPI, and my goal is to study the chapel as a alternative to the current code. Uh, my contact with chapel began about two years ago uh, when Professor Nelson Diaz, uh, my co advisor, presented it to me. I'm using the finite difference method and solve the linear system of Poisson equation with the SOAR. SOAR method. Um, I verified the solution using the method of manufacturer solution. The serial implementation in both languages is very similar, but in the in the parallel case, Fortran uh, needs an um, additional tool. So we needed to break down the domain into subdomains. And this breakdown is a Cartesian topology of process, and the eight subdomain is associated with one process. Um, how many lines are necessary to create a topology? Um, maybe something like five lines. Uh, no, uh, we needed more than 50 lines. And the word about Trapo. Um, I used the coferal comedy to try to reproduce this effect. I noticed that in chapel, I needed one line. Uh, also, in Fortran, I still needed to the communication between the subdomain. Uh, for this, uh, we needed there uh, we need the three subroutines. Um, so boundary exchange in X and Y and in Z. Um, that is, uh, I needed to, to implement more lines. In the chapel, I changed the range of the loop and just it. Um, since the chapel is row major, and the first for trend uh, is a color image. I needed to try differences difference the decomposition. For example, so that for for process, um, the best decomposition for chapel is one subdomain in a x direction, four subdomain in a y direction, and one subdomain in z. So for trend, um, I need one subdomain in x one subdomain in Y, and the four subdomain in Z. About the, the tools and the libraries, I use the GCC 20.2.0 and the, the less, uh, latest version of Chapel uh, using the building. Uh, there is the version for Fortran MPI available in the OIL cluster. Um, so, the oil cluster is hosted at the, the University of São Paulo and the, is open to scientific community in Brazil. This particular cluster um, for single locale, locale has 28 cores, um, five, five, six parallel processes available. Um, Regarding the performance, the serial version of Chapel is 2% faster than the Fortran version. And the, and the uh, Chapel was up to 50% faster than the Fortran MPI version using the H threads. Um, uh, I like Chapel because I can use a four hour loops and the, I don't need to think about it, create domain decomposition or process 
communication. Um, they resulted with the foral and yellow bar, and the coforal is a blue bar. Are similar in single location or one node. Uh, Chapel provide the, an easy language, uh, reduce the number of line implemented, it's fast to as for Tron and MPI. Uh, we, we cannot yet update the, the MPI simulation on time for a new GCC version. Uh, we are currently, currently uh, trying to expand the Chapel for more locales and to, to use it, the the compositions with distribution, for example, using the block gist and the etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. Um, but it, we still need some some technical support for that. Okay. Um, thank you for for the opportunity. I would like to thank Livia and Nelson, my advisors, Leonardo, my technical support, Angie, Demia, Jeremy. Vess and the Chapel community. Thank you again. And now I'm open to questions. <laughs>